Hello and welcome. In this video, we will show you how to update your firmware. It is important to perform these firmware updates as they will ensure your cameras continue working optimally through improvements, changes, and bug fixes. The firmware version varies depending on your camera model. If there is a more recent firmware version available, you will see a small eye icon just above the streaming area. Tap on that icon and follow the on-screen instructions. If you do not see the eye icon, you can verify whether you are running the latest version by going to Camera Details in the Hubble app. The instructions for this are as follows. Firstly, if your camera comes with a backup battery, ensure that it is connected to the charger and has at least 40% battery. Next, ensure that you are running the most recent version of the Hubble for Motorola Monitors app. Open the app and go to the camera list. Tap on the gear icon next to the camera which you'd like to update. Select camera details and you will see the firmware version listed. Finally, tap on check to see if there is an update available. If there isn't, you are told that your firmware is up to date. If there is an update available, follow the instructions shown on screen. Important! When the app is updating the firmware, do not navigate away from the screen. Remain on the same network and do not reset your camera until the firmware update is completed. This may take between 1 and 5 minutes. If these steps don't work, or if you've been informed that there is a more recent version, but the app indicates your camera is up to date, it may be due to one of the following reasons. When you are away from home with your mobile device connected to a different Wi-Fi network, or using data, the firmware update may fail. In that case, we suggest you update the firmware locally instead. That is, with both your mobile device and your Hubble camera connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Ideally, while you are physically near your router. The firmware can be updated only when your camera is online and you see the green dot in the Hubble for Motorola Monitors app. If your camera is offline, you may need to reboot it. Unplug the camera and plug it back in to bring it online. If a reboot does not help, you may need to delete the camera from the app and pair it again. First, delete the camera from the camera list. To delete a camera, go to the camera tab. Click on the gear icon of the camera you wish to remove. If you are using an Android phone, click on the trash icon at the top right corner of your screen. Confirm the deletion of the camera. If you are an iOS user, click on the remove camera button at the bottom of your screen. Now you can add your camera again. Begin the setup process by clicking on the blue plus icon listed in the lower right corner of the camera list. Follow the instructions given on screen. For a video instruction of how to set up your camera, please see the links below. In this case, you will need to delete the camera from the Hubble for Motorola Monitors app, perform a hard reset, and go through setup again before you can update the firmware. Be aware that as a result of the hard reset, you may lose events and your settings fall back to default. We suggest you save any events you want to keep before the hard reset and you check your settings again once you've completed the hard reset, setup, and firmware update. Once you have deleted the camera from the camera list in the Hubble for Motorola Monitors app, perform a hard reset. First, hold down the pair button on your Hubble camera. Second, turn your Hubble camera off while continuing to hold the pair button. Third, Turn your Hubble camera back on while still holding down the pair button and wait until you hear a beep and the LED starts blinking. This may take up to 20 seconds. Finally, open the Hubble for Motorola Monitors app and add your Hubble camera again the same way as shown before. With the camera now set up and online again, you go into camera details and tap check to upgrade the firmware.